Hi, my name is Corey. Welcome back to Trade Winds RV. Today I'm going to show you the 2014 Sportsman Classic 17 located here at Trade Winds RV. The Sportsman Classic is manufactured by KZ, who has held the RVDA's DSI award for the past 12 years. For those of you that aren't familiar with that, that's the Dealer Satisfaction Index. Dealers around the country vote for the most uh, reliable, efficient manufacturers, and only 10 a year are awarded. Uh, again, KZ has held that title for 12 years straight now. Uh, if you'd like a sales price or have any further questions after the walkthrough, give me a call at 1-800-RV-OCALA. That's 1-800-786-2252. Don't forget to like us on Facebook at Tradewinds RV Inc. and visit our webpage, www.tradewindsrv.com. The exterior length of the 17 RVS is 17 feet 11 inches with a width of 7 feet. The exterior height, including the AC, is 8 feet 11 inches with an interior height of 75 inches. Your unloaded vehicle weight is going to be around 2,500 pounds with a 420 pound dry hitch weight. Uh, your carrying capacity of this RV is going to be uh, just under 1,000 pounds. Okay, starting with the exterior features on the 2014 Sportsman Classic 17. Here you'll notice the manual tongue jack. Uh, your propane tank is going to be mounted right behind that. It's a 20, 20 pound propane tank with the automatic changeover regulator. Um, also, a 24 series deep cycle battery uh, is included with the purchase of this RV. You'll notice a nice uh, diamond plate rock guard, very sturdy, going to protect against debris, damaging your RV and hold resale value. Also, you'll notice the uh, shutter close uh, window here for viewing the outdoors. Okay, moving further down the side, uh, you do have a nice amount of storage right here in the front of this RV. Uh, your spare tire is not going to be located in there, there's actually got a, a carrier that will be uh, uh, mounted on your reinforced steel bumper in the back. Um, also on each corner of this RV you do have uh, stabilizing jacks uh, for stability when you're inside. You notice the 10 foot manual awning located right here. You have two service points for the back of your refrigerator if you need to get in there and uh, get it serviced. Your 110 volt outlet is going to be located right here and also your uh, suburban furnace exhaust is right there. Uh, you also notice the Dexter axle never adjust uh, electric brakes so you don't have to finagle with those and keep getting those just right. Um, you also notice an exterior light. Here we are on the back side of the 17. Uh, you will notice the reinforced steel bumper which is going to mount your spare tire and carrier. Your cable input for when you're at a campground is going to be located right here. And the roof of this RV is actually an aluminum roof, and KZ offers a 12-year limited warranty with that. Okay, here we are located on the back left side of the RV. And down here will be your dump station for your water tanks, and your uh, water gallon capacities are as follows. Fresh water tanks are 10 gallon, uh, black water is 9, gray water is 20 gallons. Okay, moving on down, you have a round of 6-foot slide right here. It's going to open up the interior quite a bit. Underneath that, uh, if you can see that, there is a single axle trailer with a 3,500 uh, pound weight capacity on 14 inch tires. Moving on further down, here's your 30 amp supply stored inside, so uh, it's going to be kept out of the weather. Uh, your six gallon water heater right here made by Suburban. Okay. Next to that is going to be your uh, potable water uh, where you're going to fill up your fresh water tank if you're going to be going dry camping. This camper is self-sustained so you're able to do that. And here's your city water connection for when you're at an RV park and you need to hook up to water. Okay, I want to start with the interior features uh, to show you the layout. Separated by a solid wood door, you do have a uh, bathroom here. As you'll see, uh, pretty standard. You have a toilet with a hand flush and a stand-up shower with an exhaust fan overhead. Okay, as soon as you walk in the door, you do have some nice storage right here. Uh, a little bit of hanging space up there and uh, more storage overhead of that. Uh, down below, you'll notice your breaker panel located right here. Up top is going to be your suburban furnace uh, thermostat where you're going to set how hot or cold you'd like it to be. Okay, moving over here, as I mentioned before, you have your nice slide here that's going to open it up quite a bit. Uh, you have a freestanding table here. Uh, this can be taken outside uh, if you need to. This is also a jackknife sofa for extra sleeping space. Uh, converts as easy as that. Okay, moving forward, I want to go ahead and show you the, uh, the uh, sleeping area inside this RV. This is a nice queen sized area. Again, three windows on either side, on, on all sides, so you're going to have a nice viewing area if you have uh, some nice scenery to see. Um, also, the uh, storage that I mentioned before is accessible from underneath this bunk, or this bed, sorry. And you have overhead storage above, which does pass through all the way through your RV. Also, above my head, you'll notice the Coleman Mach. Uh, air conditioning is a 13.5 BTU air conditioning. Here's going to be your TV backer location, uh, equipped with 12 volt 
uh, service, cable input, and 110 volt outlet. Your TV antenna is located right there, just a manual crank. Uh, Norco refrigerator, again, very popular brand, made in the USA. It's a 4.6 cubic foot refrigerator, has the freezer combo in it. Uh, you can set the temperature, different modes, uh, run it off electric or LP. Here's going to be your two burner stove, uh, made by Suburban. Beneath that's your furnace, the 16,000 BTU furnace, uh, also made by Suburban. Your high point microwave is right here. Uh, it's 1.35 kilowatt with a carousel in the middle. Um, you also have storage right here, uh, which does pass through to right here. Beneath that, you'll see your sink, uh, single basin sink, uh, chrome finish on the faucet, hot and cold options. Um, here again, you'll notice the slide in, slide out drawers, and then some storage here uh, that passes all the way through. All right, that concludes my walkthrough of the 2014 17 RBS Sportsman Classic made by KZ, located here at Tradewinds RV. If you would like a sales price or you have any further questions, give us a call at 1-800-RV-OCALA. That's 1-800-786-786. 2252. Find us on Facebook at Tradewinds RV Inc. Give us a like and go to our webpage www.tradewindsrv.com. I want to thank you for watching and we look forward to earning your business.